Hey guys, it's me, Mitch, and today I'm going to be unbagging five packs of Lego minifigures, set 71000, series 9, series 5 and up, and each and each pack contains one Lego minifigure, warning choking hazard, 16 to collect in a series, and uh, nothing really on the back there, but on the front, you get this really nice shiny silver packaging, series 8 was a black packet, like a matte black packet, so this is kind of cool that we get a new metallic silver and on the front you've got nine of your figures as usual so um let's get right to unboxing these really good, nice looking packs i have my knife as usual i gotta get this knife a name because some people some a lot of youtubers like give their knives names um so i might start doing that and i only use it to make clean cuts because i can open it without that so first i'm going to show you guys the checklist it's really nice really good figures. I actually really like all the figures in this series. And there's the back. So as I get figures, I'm going to check them off. So let me just go grab a pen really quick, guys. I'll be right back. Just saw a pen somewhere around here, guys. Never mind that. Uh, couldn't find a pen. Wait a sec. Aha! I found a pen. Okay. So let's see what, what figure we got. And we got the Hollywood Starlet. Not bad for our first figure. So I'm just going to put her together really quick. Not my favorite figure, but still cool. As with all figures. Whoops. There aren't really any figures in the series that I don't like, so that's nice. Uh, so here's her little golden trophy. She's got a really crazy hairpiece. And her face is what you would expect of like a Hollywood star. And then she's got like a really shiny dress. No back printing, but still very nice figure. And for those of you who don't know, Lego minifigures come with a 4x3 display plate. So there's the Hollywood starlet. By the way, she is number 3 on your checklist for series 9. So, uh, let's move on to the second pack without any further ado. I'm pretty sure I got all different figures, guys, so... That's nice. Let's see if I can actually get this open. Hold on, I'm gonna have to cut through the part in the middle. With my, uh, knife, guys. Ow. Almost cut myself there. I said ow in anticipation. Okay. And, ooh, cool. I got the Roman Emperor. I was looking forward to this figure, actually, guys. Really looking forward to him. Uh, let's see. Okay. Just wanted to see what hand his tile is supposed to go into. So he has a little scroll. This is Vini Vidi Vici, which, according to a video I saw, means... Um, I come, I see, I conquer, I think, something like that. He's got some really nice detail on him. Um, uh, some shiny bits. Just what you would expect for a Roman Emperor. Got a nice crown in his hair there. And uh, let's get right on to the next pack, because why not? Oh, all right. He's number five on your uh, checklist. So far, we've got number three and number five. Two down, 14 to go. Uh, there's some figures I really wanted in this series, guys. Like, extremely wanted. So, let's hope I get some of those. Oh, yes! I got the Cyclops! Really looking forward to this figure. Uh, one of my favorites in the series, actually. He's got a double-sided head, guys. Really nice. Um, got some nice front and back printing. And a cool, like, leg printing as well. And some nice, uh... Actually, you know what? I'm gonna do it like that. And some very nice uh, sculpting on that headpiece there. And he's also got a neat little uh, spiked club. Um, so there's the Cyclops. Very cool. I, once I get the whole series, guys, I will be doing a full review. So that's why I'm not going too in-depth. And the Cyclops is number two. So, uh, yeah. We're down to our last two packs, guys. Just gonna cut open the second to last one. 
And it is. I got the Alien Avenger. Oh yeah. And I'm going by the names that Lego.com gave them, guys. Not lame names. Um, got some really nice printing there on the front of the torso and on the legs. Got some nice shoulder pad printing as well. And he's got his uh, really cool like alien head print. And uh, he also comes with the ADU gun in black, just like the Galaxy Patrol from Series 7. Yeah, feels like such a long time ago. And he is number 11. So, uh, yeah, there's the Alien Avenger. Final pack, guys. Number 5 pack. Well, it, I hope it's not number 5 because I already got number 5. No, let's, let's move these a little bit more into the view of the camera. There we go. Okay, guys, final pack for today. I'm gonna get more so I can complete the entire series. So that'll be fun. What is it? I'm gonna give you guys a little peek. Battle Mac. Oh, yes. The Battle Mac. Very awesome. Got some nice orange, white, and black detailing going on there. And some really nice, uh, a really nice chest piece for armor thing there. And some nice head printing as well. And a cool helmet. And he doesn't hold any accessories, but he still looks really awesome. Looks like he could really beat up that uh, Alien Avenger. So yeah, guys, that's what I got. Alright. <laughs> wow. He's number 13, the uh, Battle Mac is. So yeah, guys, that's what I got on my first five Series 9 minifigs. Um, I got the Hollywood Starlet, the Roman Emperor the Cyclops, the Alien Avenger, and the Battle Mech. So, uh, yeah, guys, please like, comment, and subscribe, and stay tuned for more videos. Bye.